take it away. All right. Hi, everyone. I'm Max. I'm part of Egalia's Chromium team, and I want to share a bit of my work that I did on fallback tab dragging for Ozone Wayland. So first of all, let's recap how tab dragging should usually look like. This was recorded on X11. You can... Nope. My videos are funky. Let's see if I can do it not in the presenter view. Give me a second. I have to represent this. Uh, oh, over here. All right, great. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You can see that you can drag tabs out of a window and it detaches into a new window that moves together with the mouse while you drag it. Um, sadly, this does not work on Wayland currently. Instead, it looks like this. The new window just opens somewhere on the screen. It does not move together with the mouse while you drag it. And if you merge it back into another window, it just disappears again. This is not great UX. And there also have been some crashes because of tab dragging on Wayland. So why doesn't it work on Wayland? Um, there's mainly two reasons. The first reason is that Wayland clients don't know about global screen coordinates. They only get um, service local coordinates relative to their own windows. And also Wayland client can't control the window position on their own. There's really strict rules that are enforced by the compositor. And together, these two reasons mean that we can't move the window that contains the detached tabs with the cursor while dragging. You can make this work just as on any other platform by extending the Wayland protocol, which is what a colleague of mine, Nick Diego, did. He wrote the extended drag protocol extension, which extends the regular drag and drop capabilities to implement this tab dragging. The only drawback is this is currently only supported by EXO. So we need some form of fallback for all the other compositors. This is where I come in. I implemented what I call fallback tab dragging. Looks like this. The idea is that we don't create a new window until the user releases the mouse. And to signal that there's something going on, we just show a little drag icon. So in theory, it's really simple. In practice, it's been quite complicated to integrate this well into the big tab dragging state machine. So we definitely need to test this. However, there's some problems because input emulation doesn't really work well on Wayland as soon as there are multiple browser windows are open, which is kind of central to tab dragging tests. So to fix this and some other issues, I'm working on a new Wayland testing protocol extension together with help from Google's lacrosse UI team. And as soon as that's landed and implemented, hopefully we can ship fallback tab dragging by default, until then, it's behind a feature flag. You can test it out yourself if you want to. Thanks to these people for reviewing my patches and uh, helping with the design, and thank you. Next up will be Antonio.